الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم وبارك على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين أما بعد This is the vocabulary for the first lesson on القول السديد في الرد على من أنكر تقسيم التوحيد and so this is for the first page page nine after the introduction we have on the وزن فعل ثلاثي مزيد حذر يحذر حذر the master is تحذير it means to warn warn people against something or from something so تحذير is the warning and this is the word the words that are in yellow are the ones that are in the text the person doing is محذر and the thing that it's done about is محذر but there's a حرف جر that's going to come with it محذر منه because you say حذر من فلان you know, he warned against this individual. So, Fulan is Muhadharun Minhu. Next one on the Wazn of Fa'ala, Mujarqat. Naqaba Yankudu Unqud. That means to, we could say refute, but really it's like you're taking apart something. You're taking apart whether it be uh, an argument or an object. So, نقد شبهة. This is how it's very often used. يعني there you take this ambiguous speech of somebody, you take it apart in order to clarify it. So the master of this is نقدون. The person doing it is ناقدون. The thing that it is done to is منقودون. Then on the وزن of افتعل. اشتبه يشتبه اشتبه. That means to be ambiguous. اشتبه اشتبه الأمر. The matter became ambiguous. What does that mean exactly? It means that it became unclear in a way that you cannot make the difference between truth and falsehood anymore. اشتبه الحق بالباطل. Truth and falsehood became mixed up. So the mustard is اشتباه. That is the fact of becoming unclear. Or شبهة. This is the ambiguous thing. The ambiguous speech, the ambiguous argument. The thing is mushtabihun, what has become unclear, and then you have mushtabahun, which is the maf'ul, however, is not used much. Then on the wazan of af'ala, you have ashhara yushhiru ashhir. So you can see within this word these three letters, sha ha ra from mashhurun or shahirun, famous, known. So as we said, the wasn't of af'ala, it makes the <coughs> action upon something else, a ta'addi. So, ashhara, uh, it means to make something or somebody famous. The name of that action is ishharun, the mustar. The person doing it is mushhirun, the one who it's done to is mushharun. Then on the wasn't of taf'ala. تحتم يتحتم تحتم تحتم it means to become inevitable or to be inevitable so تحتم is the master the thing which is inevitable is something which is متحتم and then you have the مفعول متحتم not really used then فعل أمر يأمر مر that is uh, to order أمر the order the person doing it is أمر and the person uh, ordered to do something or the thing that you ordered to do is مأمور so we can say فلان مأمور فلان has been ordered or he's receiving orders from somebody or we can say um, albir ma'murun, uh, being well doing, generosity, uh, all these meanings of albir is ordered. We've been, yani, in other words, this thing has been ordered for us to do, and usually we're going to say ma'murun bihi. Fa'ala, again, on the words of fa'ala, naha yanha. Inha, the opposite of Amara, to forbid. So, Nahyun, 
is the prohibition. The person doing it is nahin. This is a ism manqus, meaning it's originally nahi, but go back to the rules of ism manqus at the beginning of Medina Book 2, Lesson 1 or Lesson 2, maybe Lesson 3, I believe, and you will find the details on how this functions. And the, uh, the thing which has been forbidden is called manhiyun, and we say manhiyun anhu. Right, the person would be manhiyun, and the thing which is forbidden is manhiyun anhu, just like the thing which we are order with, ordered with is ma'murun bihi. So the second paragraph on page nine, I mean it's the third paragraph, counting the introduction, we have on the wazan of istafala, istahqa. You can see the word haq in here. All right, so haq means truth but it also means a right so istahaqqa it means to get a right i.e. to deserve istahaqqa yastahiqqu istahiqqa and the masdar is al-istihqaqu istihqaqun yani the fact of deserving something the person deserving something is mustahiqqun and the thing which is deserved mustahaqqun like for example المبلغ uh, المستحق the amount that needs to be paid that is obligatory to be paid right like when you have to pay your bills etc المبلغ المستحق all right then on the wazan of فاعل we have عاقب يعاقب عاقب it means to punish then we have the مصدر قياسي meaning like we would apply the rules of sarf to it, it would be mu'aqabatun, and this is correct. Or another one, which is uqubatun, the punishment, and this is the one which is in the text. Right? When we have two masadir, I shall give you, uh, I shall underline and put in bold the one that is in the text. Mu'aqibun is the person punishing, and the punished person is mu'aqabun. Next, on the wazan of ifta'ala, we have it that means to agree. The master is ittifaqun, agreement or consensus. Consensus, we usually use ijma'un. They are somewhat synonyms, but we usually use ijma' as, you know, a higher level than ittifaq. Then we have muttafiqun for the people who are agreeing. Right, the fa'il and the matter which we agree upon is muttafaqun alayhi with the harf jar. Muttafaqun alayhi. Then on the thulathi mazid fa'ala, we have qatala yaqtulu uqtul to kill. The masdar is qatlun, the killing. The person doing it is qatilun, and the person being killed is maqtulun. Then on the wazan of fa'ala, we have bayyana. As we said, the wazan fa'ala is ta'addi. It means you put the meaning on the next person or the next object. So bana, the thulathi of this one, bana, it means to become clear, as in to stand out from something else. Right? Bana ti shajara, like the tree stood out in a way that you could see it. So, bayyana, you make something stand out. It's like you differentiate between two things in order to clarify which is what. Bayyana, you bayinu, bayin, in order to clarify. Then we have tabiyinun, which is the masdar qiyasi. And we have bayanun, and this is the one which is in the book, right? Clarification. The person doing, doing it is mubayinun. And the thing which is done to Mubayyanun. So that's what it that's it. That is most of the vocabulary for this first lesson. Subhanakallah bihamdik shadwan la ilaha ilan tastafiru kwa tubu ilaik.